ha ha. It was simple to make the truck run off the road. And now that it's crashed, I'll be able to take all those Lego Super Mario minifigures for myself. Now, which one will I open first? Hey, look at Goomba. I hope I find it. Aha! Surprise attack! Eat battery! Oh, it missed. But, uh, what in the name of, uh, Bruce Wayne is a handsome guy? Has happened here? Uh, Raider shouldn't be lying on the floor all beaten. I feel there's some sort of foul play at hand. Whoa, who are you? Some kind of, uh, supervillain? It's -a me, Amalio. Who are you? Well, I'm Batman. Oh, a Batman. No, 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 no. My name's Batman. Ah, Batman. No, Batman. Oh, it's a Batman. No, my name's Batman. Batman. A Batman. <laughs> oh, hey, hey, it's me. It's, uh, uh, sorry, I'm late. Uh, Mr. Mario, his name is Batman. Oh, it's a Batman. No, no, my name's Batman. Batman, the Darker Knight. Oh, I see. It is a Batman, the Darker Knight. No, no, the the Dark Knight, like like nighttime. He's like a knight, but dark. Okie dokie. Whoa, that guy was quite unique. Whoa, Batman. Wow. Robin, where are you going? Come back. Still gotta open up these mystery bags. Whoa, Batman, what happened? Ah, uh, I hate it. Every time some new Edo who appears, I die in some new and creative way. Hey, Batman, uh, anyone tell you you're flashing? Hey, never you mind about that, Robin. Let's open up these new blind bags. Okay, it's review time! Now, my name's Oz, and today we're gonna be doing a quick review. Let's move these guys where you can see them, because it's pretty rare. I like that new Batman suit, by the way. Click the thumbs up like button if you want me to use this Batman more. Usually I use, like, the dark black one, but I thought I'd kind of do that guy, because he's, I don't know, cool. <laughs> he's good. <laughs> to sum it up, he's cooler. Uh, now, today we're gonna be reviewing the Lego Super Mario minifigures. There's 10 to collect. I've only got four to open up today, but if you want me to review more, then let me know by clicking the thumbs up like button. And say if I get over 40, 40 likes, then um, I'll go out and buy the rest of them uh, every so often when there's a new series like this. I'll just do a test. I'll like buy a few, just to test if you guys like it, and then if you do, I go out and buy more. So, in this case, uh, we're gonna do these ones. Now, I noticed there are these serial numbers here. These are brand new, by the way. Like other, I haven't seen these reviewed anywhere else. So it looks like Australia got them first. But as you can see, each one has a different number at the back there. So I'm assuming it's some sort of code. Uh, so what I'll do as I open these up, I'll write down who we have and then I'll put them down in the description down below. That way, if you go to buy any of these yourself, you can just look in the description and know exactly who you're gonna get. Kind of takes the guesswork out of it. Um, but yeah, like I said, as far as I can see, I just did a quick look on YouTube then. I'm the first channel to be reviewing these, um, unless I've missed something, but uh, that's why I'm kind of going to be clueless as to what these look like or how to assemble them. But hopefully, hopefully it has guides. Anyway, so first up, in this one, this is the one ending in 2150 or 21SO. We have, okay, someone like purple and fishy. I'm assuming maybe that dude, but let's have a look. I'm just gonna move the camera down so you can watch as I assemble it. Now, there is some sellotape. Okay, now this hopefully is a checklist and an instruction set. Okay, I'm guessing we got the urchin there. So we got the urchin. Let's look at some of the other characters we can get. There's Bullet Bill, uh, Peeper. <laughs> There's other languages underneath. I'm just gonna read the English one. Fuzzy Beetle, Urchin, Spiny, Fuzzy, Blooper. Eep cheap, <laughs> cool name, uh, Bob Omb, and uh, Paragumba, Paragumba, cool. And like, it looks like they come with little accessories. Now, all of these come with, well, no, they don't come with, you're meant to buy the starter course first, and then these are kind of characters, oh, there it goes there, starter course, plus these, just kind of adds to the fun, just kind of helps you uh, decorate the game a bit more uh, if you have these other characters. Now, here are the instructions. So, I'm gonna quickly assemble this. I'll stop talking and uh, we can quickly go through it. Okay. 
Okay, so first up we have the urchin. Now, as you can see, he wasn't that hard to make. Uh, a lot of unique pieces here, like those starfish, this kind of whole base plate down here. Uh, kind of everything. Those flowers, I've never seen that color before. Those seaweeds are new. Uh, that is new. <laughs> Where to start? But having those cool eyes have been handy too. Um, I think this is part of the game. I don't have the game myself or the starter pack I think you should say, but I think that has something to do with it uh, But very cool and it also comes with a few spare pieces uh, So yeah, that's very cool. So his name is Urchin. Now let's get straight on to the next one Because uh, I don't like my videos going for too too long uh, You guys may not either so anyway, let's go now these were so I bought these in Australia They're five dollars each, but I have seen online well I'm expecting it also that they're gonna be about four dollars in the US uh, if you are in the US uh, but yeah five dollars in Australia that's where I got it from um, now this time we have actually I can just use this checklist it looks like I'm guessing oh, I'm guessing the ghost I'm guessing it's Peeper okay anyway let's find out we'll assemble him and we'll know for sure so again I'll go quiet and quickly build him ah I need the instructions Okay, hold on, instructions, there we go. Okay, let's go do it, let's do it. Now, the second one we have is the peeper. Now, he's very cool. Again, I love that huge base plate. Imagine all the things you could use that with. Like, imagine making a huge monster with that kind of creepy face. All it is, is a disc like this. Let me put it back on. Oh, man. There we go. Uh, and it's very cool. Not many unique pieces here except the base plate, which I can quickly show you what the underneath looks like. Very cool, but you could use that with a lot of things. Uh, and so far, these are great value. One thing I've just realized, while building that is that these even if you get double ups it doesn't matter because in Mario's there is a lot of duplicates like you don't just see one peeper or one of uh, I've forgotten his name already urchin there's heaps of them as well as that if you ignore that then you can even just use the parts you don't even need to keep it as a peeper you can just break it up and uh, use it in I don't know anything else so nothing goes to waste it doesn't matter if you get double ups it's no big problem now uh, next one we have oh oh no another peeper is that his name yes another peeper okay so that that means my my thought about those codes were wrong look oh where are we there two two s o and two zero s o it means nothing because they they are very much the same guy so I'll quickly assemble this guy and then we'll move on. Okay, now that's, there's, there's the other peeper there, exactly the same as the other one. Now on to the last one. So yeah, I won't put the codes down before, below because I don't think the codes exist now. That's the problem with being the first is that, uh, that uh, I don't know, you, <laughs> you're the first. You gotta work things out yourself. Okay, so at least we don't have another double up though. This looks like uh, that dude there. What's his name? Uh, his name is Paragoomba. Yeah, maybe Paragoomba or Ipcheep. Maybe, we'll find out as we build them. Uh, where's the instructions? I think it's this one here. Okay, so let's quickly do it. Now there we go, turned out to be a power Goomba. Now this guy again has lots of nice unique parts. Uh, I don't think those are unique, but they're just really handy to have. That little cloud he's standing on is unique. I think those wings are unique. I've seen wings before, but not ones exactly like that. Uh, and not to mention that cool face and his feet are unique too. Actually, I'll quickly, I should be able to pull it off. There we go, that kind of feet piece is pretty awesome too. You could use that for lots of things. Uh, but now he's very cool, there's a power Goomba. Um, and that is the last guy we've found today. So again, guys, if you like this video, let me know by clicking the thumbs up like button. If I get at least, I'm gonna say 30, I can't remember what I said before, 30 likes, I'll go ahead and buy more of these. Um, subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. Uh, but guys, until I see you next, have a great week. Take care of yourself, and I will catch you next time.